What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Yellow Walker right here on our Gym Leader Draven channel. Okay, so... What else is next? Oh, yeah, we're in Celadon City, yes. The leafy green place. That's just a... Just, that's just me saying it. And, uh, this is, uh, like I said in our last episode, where the brunt of our, uh, activities will be taking place. Um, we're gonna be taking a small tour right here, and then, you know, maybe having one or two battles. Maybe just one. Or two. Depending on what we got right here. So, as you can see, there is a Team Rocket member. Yes, you're not kidding. Keep out of Team Rocket's way. Hmm. Apparently Team Rocket's right here. I don't know. And, uh, this guy right here is like, this is my pal, my trusted pal, Polyrath. It evolved from a poly world when I used a water stone. Pretty cool. Look at that. Ribby. Ribbit. Apparently it's a frog or something. Now, there's a lot of things you can actually find right here in Celadon City. One being the uh, the casino, I believe, and then or the game corner, and then the Celadon City department store. Now, if you go right here, I gotta go back out. Hold on. This is the Celadon Mansion. Now, this is where you're actually gonna find something pretty interesting. Um, if you go right here, well, uh, this is just me taking a tour. Ladies right here is like, my dear Pokemon, keep me company. Meowth even brings me money home. Oh, you have an adorable Pikachu with you. You look like a fantastic duo. You're making me jealous. Yeah, I kind of. A little. I mean, Pikachu is, he, he did hate me at first, but we're, we're chumps. We're compadres. We're amigos. We're friends. We're pals. We're buddies. You know, you guys get that. He's my buddy. My partner in crime. Basically, the Pokemon that I go to to zap the crap out of everybody. Now, if you go right here, this is uh, the developers of the, this game. Um, I wrote the story, isn't Erica, or I wrote the story, or isn't Erica cute? I like Misty a lot, too. Oh, and Sabrina. I like her. Oh, yeah, I love Sabrina. She's pretty hot. Scary hot. I'm the graphic artist. I drew you! Really? Look at that. Pretty good. And then me, I'm the programmer. Who the heck are you? Is that right? I'm the game designer. Filling up your Pokédex is tough, but don't quit. When you finish, come tell me. So we got a little bit of a task right there. Once we complete the Pokédex, which we eventually will, um, we'll back, we'll go back to him for just a you know a slight minute just to complete this whole game right here. Now, as you can see, uh, you can't go anywhere right here, but there is a secret door. So we're gonna have to go through the back door right here in this, uh, the Celadon Mansion. And uh, of course, many of you guys who, many of you old school gamers, you guys already know what's in there. But for those who are getting introduced to the older versions of Pokemon Yellow and uh, Red Blue, you'll find something pretty awesome. And uh, yeah, depending on when this comes out, um, yeah, it might be the same way as in uh, Pokemon uh, Go Pikachu, Pokemon Go Eevee. I'm sorry if I'm screwing up the names. You know, those new Pokemon games that are coming out. So, here we are. I know everything. Really, do you know everything? Let's see. Talk to this gentleman. He's like, I know everything about the world of Pokemon in your Game Boy. Get together with your friends and trade Pokemon. Yeah. This guy's like, it's a template. It's a template or a pamphlet on the TMs. There's, there are 50 teams in all. There are also five HMs that can be used repeatedly. Silphco. Hmm. That's it. Okay, whatever. Okay, so let's see what this says. Trainer tips. Using Game Link Cable. Oh, God. Okay, so we already know all these things, guys. Um, so, back in the day. Back in the, you know, the, the late 90s, early 2000s. We didn't have this whole Wi-Fi thing. You know... It was easy for us to just trade Pokemon, like in Pokemon Go, uh, the 3DS way, you know. The whole Wi-Fi thing didn't exist in Game Boys. We actually had to have a, 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 a cable, a link cable to actually trade with other trainers uh, <laughs> in the Pokemon world. And you know how hard it was to actually find somebody who had a link cable, let alone another Game Boy Especially when I was growing up, I didn't even have a Game Boy. I had to borrow a Game Boy from my friends. That right there was tough. It wasn't until like Fire Green, Leaf Green introduced the whole uh, Wi-Fi uh, top. I can't remember what it was. But yeah, it wasn't until that that Wi-Fi existed and all that stuff on Nintendo or Nintendo uh, uh, Game Boy Advances and stuff. So now, going back to the story right here, there's a Pokeball 
well, let's grab it. And it's like, Eevee, or, yeah, we got an Eevee. Do you want to nickname that Eevee? Uh, no, not really, not right now, because, yeah, we're not going to be using them. So this Pokemon has been sent to the PC right there. So we got ourselves a new Pokemon, pretty cool, pretty legit. And uh, now it's time to go back down right here. That's already done with the first part right here, sell it on city. Now, let's see, we're gonna have to go all the way around because I guess there's something else. Something else uh, that we have to check out. Oh yes, the Celadon City Department Store. It is a very, very cool place to go to because you, you might need some healing items. Uh, elemental stones, all that stuff. So here we are, let's go ahead and check this out. Now this room right here is the top grade items for Pokemon. This is the trainer's market. And I believe this is where you, hmm. Yeah, you buy TMs right here. And wow, they cost an arm and a leg right here. I believe you can actually buy a, uh, Yes, you can also buy some healing items right here too, especially a super repel. You can't, you really can't get that in the, in the first few, uh, in the first few towns right here. Let's see, let's see, what else? What else is there? Now talk to this guy. He's like, oh hi, I finally finished Pokemon. No, not yet. This might be useful. Gives me the TM18, which is, I believe, submission. No, it's counter. Not like this one that I'm leaning on, mind you. Huh? Why do people say mind you? Oh yes, it's counter. Any physical attack will be redirected. Now, this is the best place to go to right here, in my opinion. Express yourself with gifts, Wiseman gifts, Evolution Special, Elemental Stones on sale now. So yes, this place right here, you can actually find the Elemental Stones. Um, unfortunately, in Pokemon Yellow, you can't use the Thunderstone on Pikachu because you won't want to evolve. You can buy Poke Doll, Firestone, Thunderstone, Waterstone, Leafstone, and that's basically it right there. Um... And then, uh, I think there's one more floor right here, but it's very important that we need to... Oh, no, wait. Yeah, we have two more floors. This one and the next one, I think. Talk to this gentleman, and he will sell you... Oh, yeah, this is the vitamin store right here. And as you can see, yeah, they cost a lot of money. A lot, a lot of money. So, I wouldn't, I wouldn't go there. Yeah, and then this guy just sells you any kind of battle items. And, uh, alrighty. Now we're going to go back up here. Now, this place is a very, very important area. This guy was like, my sister is a trainer, believe it or not. But she's so immature, she drives me nuts. Hmm. Let's see. I'm thirsty. I want something to drink. Huh. So, we're going to have to we're gonna have to do the honors and try and uh, get this person to shut the heck up. Here. So, we're going to buy four... Four different kinds of herbs. We're gonna buy four, four drinks right here. Three for this girl and one for a later uh, adventure. Right here. Actually, I'm not even gonna buy three or uh, four right now. I'm just gonna buy three. So if you give her one of each uh, drinks, she will actually give you a TM. So let's give her the fresh water right here, and she will actually give you the TM 13, which is, I believe, ice beam. Yes, ice beam. Very good move. I know who to teach that to. And she's thirsty yet again, so let's go ahead and give her that Sodi Pop. And we get the TM48. I think that's Tri Attack, right? No, that's Rock Slide. Another good move. And if you give her the Lemonade, of course, it's going to be Tri Attack, I believe. TM49. I think there's only two Pokemon in this game. Maybe. I think I could be wrong. I think there could be a fourth one right there. Third or fourth. Yeah, they can learn the Tri Beam Attack. It's not really. Actually, yeah, there's, I think, four Pokemon that I know of that actually uh, can actually learn to try attack in this move or in this uh, game right here. And, okay, so that's the end of that right there. And might as well go right here. Now, they're saying that there's a sleeping Pokemon around here. Believe it or not, there it is. Another Snorlax is blocking our way. Thanks a lot, you jackass. But we do have a cut technique right here. And there is something very, very special right around here. We go through the back of the cycling uh, the cycling road, and this guy's like, how'd you get in? Good effort. Like, that was a big accomplishment. But if you go right here, and you go into this house, 
You talk to this lady. She's like, oh, you found me my secret retreat. Please don't tell anyone I'm here. I'll, I'll make it up to you. Here, you can have this, but I don't have any room. Good guy. Okay. Alrighty, so what do I get rid of? What do I get rid of? Wow, I'm making it really... Oh, wow. I did not know I had that many TMs right here. Oh. Okay, so I'm going to get rid of two of these because... Yeah, I didn't get real, I didn't get burnt. But here is you found a secret retreat. Please don't tell anybody. I'll make it up to you with this, the HMO2, which is fly. Yeah, it will take you back to any town, but put it to the use. It's a good use. Wow. Tongue twisted right there. Okay, so we don't have a flying type Pokemon just yet. Um, we will be using the TM, uh, the TM or the HMO2 on. Charizard one or Charmeleon once it evolved into Charizard, and then uh, I think that will complete everything with uh, the TMs that we need. Oh no, we need Surf and Strand as well. So let us move on back to Celadon City. And uh, what does this little person say? I got I got my coughing for my friend. We got along now just because I was very very nice to it. Good for you. Good for you. And talking to this person, the game corner is banned for our city's image. Okay, so she's an activist. Now, if you have Surf across this, you can talk to the gentleman right across here, and he'll actually give you something specifically for a Chansey. Now, talk to this guy. He's like, Ma, I blew it all on the sluts. I knew I should have uh, cashed in my pri my coins for prizes. Ugh, too bad. Oh, yeah, by the way, the gym is that way. Now, we do need a Pokemon that knows cut, and, uh, well, we do have that Pokemon. So we won't have to replace it. So we will be going there later on. Now, talk to this guy. He's like, what are you staring at? I'm well, staring at some ugly guy right here. Ugly mug. And here we are in a restaurant right here. He's like, psst. There's a basement. There's a gate corner. Hmm. There is? Hmm. He's eating. The man at the table lost all his... All or lost it all at the slots. Hmm. Wonder. Let's see. Let's talk to this guy. He's like, go ahead, laugh. I'm flat out busted. No more slots for me. I'm going straight. Here, I won't need. I won't be needing this anymore. And I need to make room for that. Holy crud! Yeah, that was one of the biggest things. And you know what? I'm gonna delete these guys because, yeah. And uh, yeah. Okay. So okay. I think that's the only thing we need now. He's not gonna go into the slots anymore. He gives us the coin case. Which enables us to play the games now onto the game corner. And remember, there's like a secret area there. And now if you go right here, this is weird. Huh. He's like, don't touch the poster at the game corner. There's no secret switch behind it. Wow. Really good way to hide that. And he's like, Chief! We just shipped 2,000 Pokemon as a slot prizes. Okay, cool. And this guy's like, <laughs> the slots are just real... Uh, are just real in the uh, the dough, big time. Good. All right. Okay. So I think we have one more house right here. And this house right here. Whoa. This looks like a Pokemon Center. Now I really wish they would have done a little bit more to like extra stuff like here. Like if we could have gone to a hotel, we could have gone in it in the other versions. This guy's like, why did I bring my? Um, why did she bring her brother? Hmm. Probably because she's a good sister. I'm on vacation with my brother and my boyfriend. Sudan is such a pretty city. It is a pretty city right there. My sis brought me on the vacation. Wow. And this guy's like, Pokemon? No, this is a hotel for pe for people. We're full up. Or we're filled up. Wow. They need to fix that right there. So that's pretty much it right there. Now we have to go straight up to the game corner. Now that's the That is the place we have to go for know the real crime scene and all that fun junk. so as you can see we're in the game corner now if you walk around this whole area you will be able to find some secret coins on the floor so that's exactly what I'm gonna do right here just pressing the A button finding some coins that I need because you know what I'm a moocher like that I guess look at that 10 coins I think you're gonna find like a hundred and maybe 60 80 coins in total possibly there is an area right here that you can actually find, or you can actually get 100 coins on the floor. I don't know who would uh, drop the 100, 100 coins on the floor. That's really bad right there. Okay, 
so... Hmm. Okay, talk to this guy. Hey, what? Hey, what? You're throwing me off. Here's some uh, coins. Shoo! Get 20 coins. Of course, people are going to give you some coins. There's a trick to the... Yeah, I'm not going to listen to you. I'm not here for the gambling. I'm here for the... Uh... I'm here for the Pokemon. And there it is. There's the 100 coins that we've been looking for. Now if we just move forward, there's going to be some more stuff around here. Okay. So, no. Not right here. Talk to this guy. He's like, what's up? You want some coins? Yes. Give me some coins. Because you're awesome like that, right? That's right. And uh, there's an individual right there. Huh. But I'm still, you know, getting some coins. I'm not talking to you right now, buddy. Guy who is not uh, protecting a he uh, posts here so gently. This guy, he's like, games are so scary, but you get crazy hooked. That is true, and there we go. We found ourselves another 20 coins right here. And uh, let's see. Talk to this girl, and she's like, I'm having a wonderful time. That's good for you. And if you talk to this guy, he's like, hey, you have a better thing. You have better things to do, a champ in the making. Celadon City's gym leader, uh, Erica, she uses grass type Pokemon. She might appear do, uh, docile, but don't be fooled. Huh, I wonder why you're doing what you're doing out here. Aren't you supposed to be in the gym? Oh, yeah. <laughs> the Celadon City gym is kind of like a feminist gym. No men allowed. I don't know why. I don't know why. I really don't know. I'm not going to touch that button right there. And look at that. We found ourselves more coins. Talk to this guy. Keep it quiet. It's rumored that this place is being run by Team Rocket. I knew that already, but uh, thanks for the, the information, homeboy. And, uh, let's see. We're almost done? Oh, yes. And those are 10 coins right there. And talk to this person. Kid, what do you want to play? Oh, yes. So, let's see. How many coins did we, how many coins did we really get? So, use 220. So, I was completely off right there. Okay, so I did promise a battle. So, let's go ahead and battle. Let's go with uh, Ultra Instinct, Mr. Ultra Psycho. And he's like, I'm guarding this poster. Go away or else. Or else what? You're going to stick your Pokemon at me? So here it is, guys. Another battle against Rocket. And yes, he wants to fight. So he's coming out with his Raticate. But I'm going to come out with the best Pokemon ever, Ultra Psycho. And uh, that confusion attack will not hit him just yet. Oh, yes. Come on. Oh, you should have just fanned it right there and then. But no, these guys have to you know, catch up on their Pokemon. Critical hit. And okay. Alrighty. So let's stay with this. Let us stay with this with a, with a good confusion attack. Right there. Oh, yeah. Super effective. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Defeated you, and he's like, dang. And this guy's like, our hideout might be discovered. I'd better tell the boss. You know, you literally said your hideout. You literally outed yourself. Why? Well, I'm not even going to ask. But as you can see, there is a poster. You go here, he's like, hey. A switch behind the poster. Let's push it. And out of the blue, there's an entrance right there. So, stay tuned, guys. In the next episode, we will be going through, uh, yeah, Team Rocket uh, hideout. And we're going to save the world here. We're going to save the whole freaking world. See you guys.